G'day guys, it's Brandon Green here, host of the Let's Go Brandon Green.com podcast. Like and subscribe, we've had lots of views recently, not enough subscriptions. Fucking subscribe because I know you all love it and I know you all like it and I know you all love talking about it and me. Let's get into it. A lot of people don't know that Michelle Obama is actually a transgender. So a lot of people had no idea. I didn't know until like a year or two years ago, maybe three years ago, I found out. I was like, oh, that makes sense. So if you need to look into it, go and look into it. Yeah, it turns out um, uh, Obama, President Obama, the reason why LGBTQ is so prominent now and it had been for the last 10 plus years since he took over in 2008, he was pushing the big LGBTQ uh, agenda even though it didn't need it to be pushed. Same as transsexuals and all that transsexual for kids and stuff. Because his wife is actually transgender. Anyway, this I haven't seen this, but it'll show about how um, Michael, Big Mike, that's why you always uh, see uh, Michelle Obama called Big Mike. She went on Ellen DeGeneres. Her, her fucking mongrel was swinging around. Crazy stuff. Joan Rivers told everyone she died like a week later from some easy uh, surgery that she did. They reckon it was complications of it and ether just gone wrong or something, which shouldn't happen to rich, healthy people. But um, she said a week earlier, yeah, yeah, we all know. Um, she's a tra tranny. So let's get into it. Yeah. The name's JP Sears. I'm a private investigative forensical analysis guy and amateur Taekwondo competitor. And I have irrefutable proof that Michelle Obama is a man. The Obamas don't think you Was know. They don't want you to know. But I know that you do know. Just take a look at these Photoshop pictures. You can clearly see beneath Michelle Obama's dress mm. is a bushel of male genitals. That is a fucking big, big dick. Like, that is one big dick. Like... Look at it. That's a decent size. That's a fucking... There's even the head of it, so it's circumcised. Fucking big dick, man. Congrats, she's got a big dick. You can clearly see beneath Michelle Obama's dress is a bushel of male genitals. Yeah. And, and then also look how the male oh. genitals are circled. That's a black circle. And <laughs> even more compelling, there is an arrow drawn pointing to the male genitals. You can't make this stuff up, people. Oh, Michelle's a woman? Really? Well, how do you explain this? Yeah. Take a look at this picture of young Barack Obama. You might be asking, who is that lovely young that's, lady with that's a mustache Michelle. that he has his arm around? Answer, Big Mike. But then if you cross-reference that with a green dress picture, you might realize it's the little Mike. Big Mike. Have you ever seen big. the size of Michelle Obama's back? But the plot recently thickens because we find out that Barack Obama himself is gay. The New York Post said that Obama's biographer said that his ex-girlfriend said that he said he makes love to men every day in his imagination. And that's four degrees of separation. That's corroborated evidence. And now we consider, and got a BJ. does it make sense that a man who fantasizes about making love- And he got a BJ off a dude? And the dude died as well that came out and said that he gave um, Obama a BJ in the back of some limo or something. Look into it. Every day to men in his imagination would in fact actually be married to a man so he can make love to that man every day in reality. Game, set, match. But we've known he's been gay. Not only does he fantasize about making love to men, but he dresses all neat and he probably plays pickleball. No. Uh, evidence has been right there in front of us this entire time. Obama is very gay, which proves Michelle Obama is a man so that they can do gay things together. Not that there's anything wrong with that. I bet Obama has monkeypox. I think Trump knew all this and he was gonna release the files. That's why they've been politically persecuting him so hard. You know how Obama's name has never been brought up in connection with Epstein? Exactly. Epstein was dealing with young girls, not young boys, which means Obama was not involved, which proves Obama is gay. You still don't believe me? Take a look at this evidence. Did you write that? I don't know. I haven't done the handwriting analysis yet. And then we must consider the <laughs> chef who is dead. What yeah. did the chef see that he can't unsee that someone else saw him see? Was Michelle in an untucked moment? Answer, definitely yes. 
The chef knew everything and now he's dead. Do you know who else knew everything and is now dead? Joan Rivers. Yeah. Take a look at this. And do you think that the country will see the first, the United States will see the first gay president or the first woman well, we president? Have it with Obama, so let's just calm down. Got it. <laughs> you know Michelle is a trans. Uh, I'm sorry, she's a what? A transgender. We all know. Oh my gosh. One Joan Rivers herself knew that Obama is gay and Michelle is a trans man. And Joan Rivers didn't live too long after that. They mm. killed her. And consider this, there is a reason why Obama took down Saddam Hussein. Saddam? Sodomized? <laughs> Obama was clearly trying to kill now his inner joking. truth because he was afraid to come out of the closet. I think it was George Bush who took down Saddam Hussein, not Obama. <laughs> now you're just being homophobic. It was like early 2000s. I've been working hard on this case, putting together conclusive proof that Michelle Obama is a man and Obama is gay. I've dedicated my whole life working on this case for about the past hour and a half. And now the proof is in. Fact. Without all these lies and corruption, there's truly nothing wrong. The last thing I want to say is, Michael, we know who you are. Please and we do. come out, live your truth, and get you a drop with Bud Light. I think you should like and subscribe to Awaken with JP. Also, go watch his new live show on Rumble, Tuesdays at 1.30 p.m. Well, we didn't even get to see uh, where Obama twice referenced uh, her to be named as Michael and I. Yeah, so, like, that was why the fuck's he calling Michelle Michael? Big Mike! Anyway, you all know that... You should all know by now that... Um, Michelle Obama's a transgender. Not really too much breaking news anymore, but if it is, yeah. Michelle Obama's a tranny. 